Welcome to another episode of Collins Corner on the next one's Discovery Platform Basketball Fans. I'm your host, Colin Brown, and today we're going to check in on Bruno Fernando of Maryland. The sophomore averaged 13 points, 10 rebounds per contest in his second year on campus, declared for the NBA draft, and now is a surefire top 20 pick here in 2019. When we dive into Fernando's game, let's start on the offensive end. The first thing that pops out is his strength, explosiveness, and athleticism. He's a guy who plays the alley-oop, the pick and roll well with that athleticism, loves to finish above the rim with good force. He's got great step, drop step move in the post as well. A guy who loves to work over his left shoulder in his most comfortable situations with a nice hook shot, has good touch around the rim, and has really learned to extend the game playing face up now from 10 to 15 feet as well. His mid-range jumper is developing day after day. He's a hard worker, a high motor guy. And then on the defensive end, he's a rim protector. Now he may be a little small at 6'10 for the center position at the next level, but nonetheless that explosiveness, his leaping ability, and athleticism should help him down low, really protect the rim and body up opponents in the lane. Now when you look on the other side of it, weaknesses for Bruno Fernando, I still think there's a lot of maturing, a lot of growing to do on the offensive end. Sometimes he gets caught up in himself, does not recognize doubles quick enough, and really only goes to a certain one or two moves on the offensive end, especially in the half court. Now in transition, I thought he ran the floor well here in 2019 as opposed to 2018 when he struggled to get up and down from time to time. But nonetheless, a big time center prospect here moving forward in 2019 and a guy who should, should see valuable time at the NBA next fall. For everyone here, next one's up, Colin Brown. For all your pre-draft analysis and everything hoops, check us out on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and don't forget to subscribe on YouTube.